What's up, y'all? And welcome back to JCMNRK. It's episode two of My Rise. Last episode, <sighs> shenanigans. If you haven't seen an episode, be sure to check that one out. Without further ado, let's jump into this one. Molly Holly, what's up? I can't say that was the debut we were hoping for. No. I don't know what happened. It was like you said, I got a little inspired by Justine and I wanted to do her justice with her old finisher. So you decided to do something showy, took your eyes off what was happening and let Charlotte blindside you. Baby face. I'm sorry, I won't let it happen again. I got carried away. You did. Remember, you're here because you're good and you could be great. I wouldn't have any patience for Justine's brat, no talent niece. Mm. But don't expect everything to come all at once. You could have gone out there and had a solid match and that would have been enough, win or lose. But you bit off more than you could chew. I think I bit off enough. Charlotte just wanted to play, wanted to play. Maybe you're right. B of course I'm right. I'm a WWE legend. All right, Molly, don't get I'll too do ahead of yourself. i damage control. At least you have some goodwill from WWE management since you decided to wear the gear. But I can't imagine they'll want you to wear it again. Not exactly the sort of performance they want to be associated with Justine's legacy. Whatever. At least I'll get to wear the gear I designed next week on SmackDown. Right. Sure. Now's definitely the time to be worried about your appearance. Get your head in the game. I'll see you at SmackDown. Molly. And we'll take it from there. Molly is, is being, being too much. All right, got Justine, got Liv over here. What's up, Liv? Before I talk to, so I talk to my aunt. What was that about? I like to show off as much as the next person, but that was embarrassing. All right, all right, Liv, don't, I'm a fan now. Don't, don't be talking to me crazy. Sorry, I understand why you're upset, but I did my best. You grew up learning from one of the most talented WWE legends in history, and that's your best? All right, Liv. I did a better job teaching myself in my backyard. All right, Liv. Don't expect this to blow over with the SmackDown women's locker room. The Raw women are going to rub this loss in our faces for a long time. Whatever. Okay. Yeah, I talked to my aunt now. Did you hear that pop? What? The sound of my ankle popping or my career imploding? Oh, how is that ankle? Or more importantly, how's that ego? Ankle's okay. Ego? That's another story. Well, your gear looked great. Thanks. Sorry I couldn't do you proud. You always make me proud. Just have a better match next time. Besides, you may have made a mistake in the ring, but Charlotte still acted out of line. Right. If I was medically cleared for in-ring action, I would put the queen in her place. Believe me, I'm mad about it. But I'm not sure that Charlotte did anything you wouldn't have done. Nah, but one of the perks of having a career-ending injury is getting to apply unrealistic standards on the next generation. Mm. Why do you think I like training you so much? Right. Not the digs. Listen, I don't want to leave if you need to talk, but I got word that WWE management wants to chat before we head out. Something about the buzz online, whatever that means. Mm. You okay? I will be. I'm not, but I will be. No one ever said this would be easy. Just got to work out the kinks. Right. That's my girl. I'll find you in a bit. Yeah, Christina, Christina, she keeps things noted, but she tries to stay positive. So... I'm trying, I'm trying to play this very baby face. But what people forget is that for someone to win, someone else has to lose. It is better to win, though. Of course. Actually, speaking of winning, I have a few developments that Ruthless Digressions listeners will be thrilled to hear about. Oh. Mm. Care to share with those listeners Not or the your co-host? Like I told my niece at Survivor Series. Patience, Robin. Patience. Not Dewdrop being the women's champion. Hey! Welcome to SmackDown. Mm. Thanks. You know, after what Liv said at Survivor Series, I wasn't sure if I'd be getting the warmest welcome today. Oh, you won't be. Mm. But I have a different perspective than the rest of the girls. In fact, I'm actually usually pretty rude to the newbies because, well, I don't want them coming for my SmackDown Women's Championship, but I don't have to worry about you at all. 
All right, people, people are taking my friendship a little too lightly, you know? My friendliness. I want that championship. But I plan on coming for that championship. Sure am. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're hilarious. After your huge mistake in the Survivor Series match, I know that must have been a joke. I don't have to be rude to you at all. We can be friends. Mm. I think we're done here. Okay. All right, Dewdrop. Watch what you say, cuz. Just saying. LJ, welcome to SmackDown. How are you doing? I'm yeah, so not the debut I was hoping for. Well, you're here now and have your whole career ahead of you. Listen, I may just be a cameraman, so I can't help train you, but I've been with WWE long enough that I pride myself on knowing how things work around here. Happy to answer any questions you might have. I got a question for you, Tom. Oh, almost answered one. How do I get a match? How do I improve my skills? What's good at catering? I think I have the info I need. Thanks, Tom. I think I have the info I need. I don't need you, Tom. Fantastic. Good luck tonight, LJ. So, I know I didn't exactly get the best start, but I've got my head on straight now and I'm ready to go. That's great to hear. What do you have for me tonight? Now, here's something that's less great to hear. WWE management thinks that after everything that's happened, we should take a beat before we put the spotlight back on you. I mean, the anxious response of redeeming myself seems like more of her character. But you know what? I'm okay starting small. Nope. I'm, I'm okay starting small. Don't worry. I took your advice to heart. I'm okay with starting small, out of the spotlight. I'm not expecting to main event right away. Right. Good. Because you won't be. I'm going to level with you. Backstage sentiment is not good right now. Mm. You may be a SmackDown superstar, but you've got an uphill battle if you actually want to be on the show. Okay. So my match tonight is... Nothing. Non-existent. Dang, that's crazy. Ah. Uh, okay. What can I do? Why didn't you stick up for me? No, what can I do? What can I do? I don't want to just sit in catering. No one does. But this will all blow over. My advice until then? Find some way to make an impact. Be so good in the ring that they can't deny you. Backstage brawl? How am I supposed to do that if I can't get a match? I said I couldn't get you a match on SmackDown. There are other opportunities to wrestle. On oh, main event? Actually, I can pull some strings and get you on main event. I knew it. You'll need to find an opponent, though. Most of the roster is pretty busy with commitments on SmackDown, and I don't have time to play matchmaker. Pretty Ooh. busy or pretty mad at me, from the sound of it. Mm. Yeah, I may have heard those rumblings. Although, have you met Ava Moreno yet? She's Ooh. pretty new to SmackDown, too. And also would have something to gain with a good showing. That on girl main that event. was in the background of my doggone talk. I don't think she wants to work with me. I don't want to work with her. We've met. I'm not sure she wants to work with me. Neither of you have to work with anyone. You just have to show up and fight each other. Right. Get her to agree to that, and I'll set up the match. Okay. If there's some sort of beef between you two, lean into it. No one said the match had to be friendly. Right. I'm going to lean into it all right because she was she was talking trash as soon as we met. Well, if it isn't little Justine, okay. I would say I'm sorry how your big debut turned out, but I don't like to lie. What do you want? I feel like we got off on the wrong foot. I'm going to cut to the chase. You know what? No. Let's cut, cut to chase. the chase. I want a match on main event. Molly said she can get me one if I find an opponent. It sounds like getting that exposure could help both of us. Are you interested? Sure. Great. That was actually easier than I thought. Oh, but let me be clear. I want a match on main event, but not one against you. I want to make an impact here in WWE and make my matches count. It doesn't help me at all to defeat some jobber. What did you just call me? Okay. If I wasn't perfectly clear at Survivor Series, I like people who've come up the right way and paid their dues. Not nieces who get handed special treatment because of what family they're a part of. Okay. And if that wasn't enough, 
I certainly don't like you after you proved me right and made a mess of things. All right. Regardless of what you think of me, I don't see how just sitting around and complaining is going to change anything. I know as well as you do that no one else in the locker room is going to help you. You want to match with me? Prove that you have what it takes when you have to work for an opportunity. Pay some dues and stop waltzing around expecting special treatment. I don't waltz. We can agree to disagree, LJ. Y'all really making me, making it really hard to play babyface. See, you already had one. If we get into this shit, shit. All right, cool. I'm trying to figure out what my match is going to be anyway, because whoever's in this ring is about to get destroyed, first of all. And then whoever comes after that, destroy. You got anything slick to say, Ava? What do you want? I told you my terms. Doesn't seem like you've paid any dues at all. Okay, cool. All right. Let's got to talk to Cora here. Hey, what's up? Oh, I no. was actually hoping to see you around here. I heard you in some room. You were? Yeah, I loved watching old clips of your aunt on the network when I was growing up. So it was really cool to see you come out at Survivor Series paying tribute to her. <sighs> Would have been cooler to win. What are you doing at SmackDown? NXT 2.0 doesn't take up enough of your time? Just doing some photo shoots and a little press. Honestly, it's been nice to be backstage at a show where I don't have to keep a lookout for toxic attraction. Not that I can't stand up for myself, but it's exhausting. Want some help? If you're offering, yeah. Honestly, I think they're just jealous. They may be hot and talented, but they could never do what I do. For one, they'd fall off the skateboard. You don't mind coming to NXT 2.0? No, not at all. Hey. Not at all. It's not like I'm spread too thin with all my matches on SmackDown. Right. What? Let's put this straight on the map here. Ding, ding, ding. Let's get it. Come on. There we go. Ugh. I got to remember to change that. Christina here at NXT. Who would have thought? From the legend Justine. And now she's trying to make a name for herself. Oh! You! Girl! Oh gosh. See, now you done set, set crap up. Ah! Yo. Yo. Oh, not knocking out the ref. Mmm. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's have a little fun. I'm a oh well, I wasn't trying to get you, but you somehow was automatic. <laughs> I thought she's fit. Oh, she is. Oh, there was no reversal for that. What is this a work? <laughs> All right, just don't let don't let me get up. Just don't let me get up. Uh. Oh my gosh. She's not even holding me right. What is going on? All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's get out of here. All right, y'all having y'all fun. Y'all had y'all fun. I don't know why I'm not getting any type of reversal animation. I mean, there is no prompt to, to reverse. Look at this. I'm not able to do anything. Like, there is no prompt. No, it's there. We just acting like I'm just taking all the blows. What story is this? Uh, no. I'm tired of this. Uh, swinging around. Bam. Just like that. Okay. I knew it. I knew it. Girl. Get your butt out this ring. I'll tell you that right now. Now roll out. We know what we're doing here. Mm. Oh, she reversed it. What kind of mess? I'm not even doing anything. I won't even move. What? I swear. <laughs> so many shenanigans here. Ah. Mm. <laughs> Yo, get out of here. 
I swear when I win this, it's about to be such an accomplishment. <laughs> oh, wow. Was I meant to win that? That is hilarious. Oh, man. They didn't make none of that easy for me.